So I'm just now in Birmingham right here and I found an old Circuit City and look what it is now. It is Love Lady Thrift. So we're, we're about to go inside here and take a peek around. <laughs> Remember when you used to go into these City and where yeah. service is state of the art. Yes, you can see where they had the sign right up there too. So cool. Back to the future here. Woo -hoo -hoo. It's the old well. There it is. It's even still got the original floors. Two floors. It's, the, it's two floors. This is the biggest thrift store ever. This is like the customer service area. So this is like the service area right here of the store this whole floor has been changed if you're getting a chance to get into birmingham go to the love lady thrift store and, en and enjoy a, a throwback of old circuit city oh 10 cent coffee mugs score <laughs> right there <laughs> and you got good christian music playing in here too that's my favorite thing jars of clay jamming on the speakers cool the body so, very cool. So, but yeah, so I found the TVs here, and it looks like it's still the TVs from the original Circuit City, because you know, been that long. So we still, we're still in the standard def era. Look, it's even one of the display cases here. The Duo Pop, something or other. Video games. Ooh, the PlayStation Multi Jack. Ooh, Dreamcast. Oh, PlayStation. Cool rug right there, guys. Wow, right in the Christmas shop. High end bags, is it because they're high on the wall? This has the original plugins. This is where you know the TV and sound system stations were, or possibly even the stereos, because they still have all the multi plugins here. So you can get in here and check it out. It still has the original carpeting, and you can see where they, even the display cases were. Very cool. All the lighting up there on the ceiling is still there. Most of them not working. This is from the back of the store. Are you Jossum? Feeling kind of Jossum today. This is like the service area right here too. You come up here to this counter and you would um, you put your 1957 old stuff on here and they would charge it. It's pretty cool, huh? And you got the stairs. And look down. I didn't show that the first time we came out here. Walking right down the long hall here. This okay. she said today is plant thing she got back. She goes all the way back here. Alright, so walking out here, out the door. There it is. You stay Circuit City. Fun stuff. Alright, so we just shopped at that thrift store, which was an old uh, old Circuit City. We had a good time and um, I couldn't find the sign they were talking about where they said there was like a sign still where it said um, Circuit City but um, either way it was still pretty cool. It's like all the original like floors and fixtures. some of the displays, some of the fixtures um, and it was just all still the way it was set up when the store was open. They just you know pulled some stuff down like a sign and that kind of thing but anyway so that was fun. The crazy thing about that is too I actually went um, and asked somebody if they still like about it being an old Circuit City and she was like, oh yeah, this was an old Circuit City. We even have one of the signs like up in one of these rooms. And I was like, oh cool. So I was asking somebody else how to get up there and they didn't they didn't know what I was talking about. I said, yeah, there's no original signage here. I was wanting to see it because I felt like I stepped back in 1999. I used to go when I was uh, about 18, I would go to Circuit City and I'd go to Best Buy and there I'd be looking for my CDs, my DVDs, whatever I wanted to buy. And that was what I, that's how I would spend my paychecks. And um, yeah, those were the good old days. And so that took me back. Even though it was a thrift store, it still felt like a circuit city. It was so cool.